Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. No reason. No! 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 Talk to me. What's up, what's up, what's up? It's your boy once again with another episode of What That You Know What. Okay. Y'all saw the preview. All of this comes from a spoiled upbringing. This child has been allowed to run, am like I say, run amok, run amok throughout the family. For so many years, when they hit that teenage, that teenage years, you can't control them. Now you can tell just listen how this girl talk when when certain people are around, how things gonna go. You guys ain't gonna, y'all ain't seen, but this happens in a lot of houses. So, a lot of families have this where y'all never let no one discipline the child. Grandparents don't want nobody to discipline the child, and that child grow into a little adolescent, young teen. And then you can't control them. That's what this is. So no further ado, make sure y'all hit that subscribe, like, and share. Definitely smash that notification bell. And we're going to get hot on this. Y'all just pay this attention. This is crazy. And this just happened last year. On January 27th, 2024, officers responded to a domestic dispute between a mother and her daughter. Please. Yes. What's going on? I called y'all before because she was beating on the garage outside and it just blew up from there. So it's been verbal back and forth between both of us. I did snatch that, <laughs> that thing off her wall in her room because I, I told her you gotta go because I'm I can't her dog has destroyed the house. I gotta pay for that. It's, the bills are mounting, stuff that I gotta cover. And so I really just want her to go. Like I think she's up to this stuff. So what today, what happened today is just, just arguments? It's just arguments and she's just been throwing stuff. Before I get going on this, I see this a lot. That's another video I'm going to do where mother um, told her son to get out, 15-year-old, because they got an arm told him to get out. Where are these kids supposed to go when y'all put them out? I keep wondering when they do this, like, they got to go, they got to go. They don't care where they go now. And y'all want to put them out after you created this. So somebody else has to deal with it now. But I was asked, where the father's at? Where are the fathers? Nah, y'all don't want them around until this shit happens. But she's in her, she's in her, you can go up. She's in her bedroom. It's messy up there, but she's in her bedroom to the left. <laughs> Hey, Rachel. What? Hey, how you doing? This is how she talks What's to the officer. On? Hmm? Oh, my Wait a minute. Don't do that. He is here to help you. Hey, what's going on? I don't, wanna, I don't gotta talk to you. I don't wanna talk to you. Okay, well, your mom called. I don't give a I mean, I'm, I'm not your enemy, okay? I'm here to help. What you say? Who you on the phone with? Don't worry about it. So what's going on, man? Who are you on the phone with? Don't worry about it. I'm here to help you. Why? Why are you? Why are you? You're miserable. Okay, but I'm. I didn't do anything to you. <laughs> I'm just trying to see what's going on. If I can help you, you know, what I'm saying I, I didn't do anything to you. 
So I see you packing up stuff. Are you trying to go somewhere? I can put heart hurt. Okay, where are you? Where are you? Don't yeah, worry about it. Maybe I can help you. No, I don't need your help. I didn't call y'all. She asked for help. I didn't ask y'all for shit. Right, right. Hey, so I just keep telling you that I'm not talking to you. I'm done talking. Do you want to talk you to somebody else? Watch me pack my stuff up. I'm not talking to you. Do you want to talk to somebody else? Are you arresting me? No, I'm not. Then get the out. Is it my uniform that's making you upset? Let's let's look at this. Sadly, I've seen this before in just a spoiled child. And every time somebody talks to them, they just, with the profanity. Now, the thing is, that's an adult she's talking to. Not just take the police out of it. Just another adult come up trying to talk to you calmly. And all you keep getting is a lot of profanity. Like, she, she does this on a regular. Kids don't just start this from right here. She's been using this type of language for a while. You know what I'm saying? So... There's a lot wrong in here. There's a lot. It's Rachel, right? Do you prefer to talk to like the EMS? About what's going on? Like I'm not here to hurt you. I'm here to help you. I mean, you might, you know, you didn't call me. You didn't, you didn't call. And you want me to leave? I think you're here now. Hello. Hey, Hello. Rachel, this is okay. Rachel. Oh, now she just threw the TV on the floor. Oh, For what? I don't want y'all in here. I don't want y'all bothering me. Rachel, we're not. Is that not a clear answer? Leave me the fuck alone. Rachel, we're not with your enemies. Like, we're here. Then leave me alone. We're here to help you, mommy. I don't need help. Dude, you can help me by getting the out of my face. Get out of my sight. I don't want to talk to y'all. I don't have shit to say to y'all. You're wasting your time and you're wasting mine. Why you throw the TV down? Because I'm pissed. Connect the dots. Read the room. Get out. Rachel, just because you, you talk to us like that, don't mean that we don't, don't have give a damn. obligations legally. I so don't give a damn. We didn't, we I didn't come care. here. I don't care. Because. I don't care. Get your nerdy ass out of here. Bro, damn. We didn't come here because. I don't care. We don't need I to don't care. Here. So, Rachel. We can't leave. I don't care. That means you're gonna have to come with us. I don't gotta do a thing but be black and mind my goddamn business. We are you are home. you 18 years old? No. Right. So you gonna have to come with Shut us. Shut up. You can come with us peacefully. He, he said he not arresting me, so I don't gotta come nowhere. Get the fuck out. You know, I bet you this girl about 14 or 15 you, years you don't old. Don't have to go to jail, right? But we yeah. cannot. We cannot leave you here. So you can come with us peacefully or you can no. come with us with assistance. No, I will be all of y'all asses. Don't touch me. <laughs> yeah. You know, threatening the EMS worker. Threatening me to touch me and right. trying to bring me out of here. Don't EMS touch me. She is probably 85 pounds at the most. 90. They're talking about beating up a grown man. And another police officer in there. That's the funny part about all this. Like, she really thinks she's threatening them. Like, no, little girl. Don't touch me. Girl, shut your Steve Urban looking ass up. Like, damn, nobody worried about shit you're saying. She can't look nobody in the face. This is going to go one of two ways. I mean, my feelings are not hurt. Your feelings don't got to be hurt. Then get the out. Rachel, please. Girl, shut your ass up. You don't hear trying to play victim. You a You a now that's the grandfather.
Now, she just said she was talking to her about a Bahamas trip her daddy want to take her on. Okay. So, Mom, if Dad doing all this, he want to take her on a Bahamas trip or whatever, send her to the dad. Send her over to stay with the dad. But y'all be trying to keep him up under you because you won't, I don't know what. Y'all will do whatever in the world instead, like send that child and stay with that dad for some reason because you don't like him. You don't like who he done hooked up with, who he done married. And you sitting there fighting with this child who evidently don't give a crap about you and you don't seem like you care too much for her. You got your father in there. I guess that's who she was calling to come over there, but he can't do nothing. He can, you could tell he really don't want to be bothered with her because he doesn't probably help spoil her too. So everybody around her done spoiled her to death. Now she done got older, and now you can't do nothing with her because now she's ready to fight. Well, you're the problem. You don't and definitely some that. mental issues going on. Don't do that. He fussing with the, this his daughter, the, this the mother. No, no, it's our fault. You keep bringing up that law degree, but what lawyer job you got? Nothing. So it means shit. We don't have, we don't have it means it. shit. And you're struggling. And you're struggling too. Go to your room. You feel like a Mexican lawyer to talk to you. What are we going to do? Because this is not real. I understand what you say. Now, you know, the grandfather didn't say nothing to her when she's doing all that. But he was talking to the daughter. He ain't saying nothing to the granddaughter. See what I'm saying? That's why she thinks she can do this. Are you going to go with? Them, which how, might how be the you? Okay, I'll leave you alone. We don't even have to talk. Can you tell me the answer to these questions? What's today? Saturday. Okay. How many quarters make a dollar seventy-five? Five. No. A dollar seventy-five. A dollar four quarters make seventy-five. Three. Okay. Cool. Is Mickey Mouse a cat or a dog? A mouse. Okay. Let me ask you something else. Do you know who the president is? Biden. And do you know where you're at? Atlanta. Okay, what county? Fulton. Okay, well, I'm sorry, Rich, you have a great day. Bye. Okay, sir. She, she's alert and oriented, powerful. She don't want us to talk to her. She don't want us involved. Uh, you know. Well, I want her, but she's throwing this stuff on the floor. I just want her out. She keeps staring at my house. I, I, I completely understand that. But what I'm telling you is. <coughs> that's fine. If you can't take her, you can't right, take her. Right, that's good now. Yeah, that's and fine. And she don't want to be assessed. So that's See, that's the thing. I'm not touch it. Right. I'm not I get it. You want somebody to come get them when you tired of them. All right, look, just try to calm down. You got to go with your granddaddy, so you don't need to keep working yourself up. I'm not leaving without my dog. Because she just tried to let Gracie out the front door and go get hit by a car. I'm not leaving without my dog. To then get the dog and go. See, the thing is, she really don't want to go. Look, she don't want to go because she's been walking around and ain't packing up nothing. She's throwing something around. She wanted, she wanted to throw a tantrum and quick cause that's what she always do. But the police officer need to go ahead and get her up out of there. Stop all this soft talking. Go ahead and get her up out of there. Granddad, get her up out of there. We'll come back and get her stuff later. That's what you need to do. You're allowing her too much time to do all this. Like she ain't done nothing. I'm not here to arrest anybody. I'm here to help. You're not helping. Cause she's still. I, Rachel, that that's not nice. I mean, I don't care. What, 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 Nothing's not nice. Don't, I don't care. Don't, this one doesn't say. Don't, 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 don't say nothing about your. Don't say nothing about your mama like that no more. I don't care. She don't, can. She can. She can. She can. She can. She can, she can I don't care. Nobody control her. Where's your dog? I don't want her here. I don't want her. Rachel. Like she, she's just, ugh. Where's the dog at? They're in the backyard. I've never encountered someone so miserable in my life. Rachel. Uh, not out. No, I'm gonna keep talking because I've been silent. I've been playing it too cool. I've been too nice. I've been too. This woman says everything under the sun to me, and I sit there and just take it because I don't want to be for her. We're just going but to at a certain point in time, no, she gonna hear my mouth. She needs to hear what people need to be. What she needs to hear. That's why her life is the way it is. She's miserable. Mm -hmm. That's why she can't keep a man. That's why I know everywhere she goes to her workplace, they beefing with her because no one like her. She's 
See all that stuff right there. Let's go. Like, let's go. Look at her. See, she's not packing anything. She's just throwing stuff around from room to room. She'd have been in that closet like five times. Listen, if that door hit me, you won't go to the jail. So I need you to calm and control your I don't have to get the f out of You need to control your action, okay? Shut up your mouth. The man had to You need to control your actions because if you do something like Rachel. Okay, man. Big black somebody care? I didn't do anything to you. You're you're sitting here bothering me. Get the He's not, he's not, he's not messing with you. I'm trying to make sure this is peaceful. So I don't need you if to make sure go, shit. Get the f*** out of my face. Okay. You can catch this shit too. Like, what are you doing? Right. Right, See, that's just too much. That's too much. You got to go. I'm going to do it. I'm going to tell you like this. You do one more, you do one more thing like that, I'm telling you, you gonna go well, with shut me. Shut the f up talking to me. Rachel, I'm shut the f up now. talking to me. You gonna go shut with this Shut the f up talking to me. I'm telling you right you now. You ugly ass. I'll be whatever you, you want. You got a face on your mother club. You trying to always wipe a purple from me. Rachel. Shut the f up right, talking right. to me. Wow, boy. I'm gonna tell you like oh, this. You do one more thing. Shut the f up. I'm not even worried about you. Rachel, be quiet. Ugly ass. See. Rachel, be quiet. Ugly ass. See, no one has done anything yet to this girl. She's gotten away with this. This is why she talks the way she talks. She don't think nobody's going to take her anywhere. You got your granddaddy there. You think you can talk all this stuff. I'm going with Paul Paul. You curse your mom out. You cursed out the EMS people. Everybody is everybody's fault. I would take her a little bit. I'd have, she'd have been gone. Like you can take her out this house and you take her and put her in the car. If not, she riding with me. I wouldn't be doing all this. I wouldn't do it. Mm-mm. All that. I'm neither, you neither black one. Over here being a police officer like they ain't no people. You what the f up talking to me, you clown. You want. red clown, red face ass. Listen to all that. Listen to that. All right. I'm not gonna let her try to preach to me. All right. I'm gonna just tell you right now. You I don't give a f telling me shit. I don't care. All right. Damn, you black. Now she's supposed to be gone, but she's back up in there again. What? What? I'm trying to see what's going on, man. I'm packing my shit. I don't need you in here watching me. Oh no! I told you about that. I'm not the one. But I'm not the one here. Nobody scared of your fat ass. You don't push the door on me. Get what you can See, get. She don't want to go. go. Okay, you can come back later to get anything else. She done got herself in a right. hole and she can't get herself out of it now. But the mom want her out. All right, just get what you can get. Come on, just if you're going to go with your granddad. Now, did y'all hear the mom down there? I want y'all to see if y'all can hear this. Listen to the mom. Let's go. Okay. Get what you can get so you can go, okay? You can come back later to get anything else. Just watch. All right? Just listen. I backed it up for a second. <laughs> All right? Just get what you Where can you get. think she get it from? <laughs> come on. Just If you're going to go with your granddaddy, just the best is to get what you can get so you can go, okay? I'm here to now, help she you. down there talking with, the grand, okay? with her you're dad, the granddad. Get everything at one time. All right? Where do you think she get it from? Just come get get what you can get. You got a whole basket and stuff downstairs. You can go to your granddaddy house, clear your head, go talk to somebody, okay? I'm not here to hurt you. Let me want to try to hurt me. I'm not here to hurt you. I'm not here to take you to jail, okay? <laughs> Clearly, you've been distressed, and you need to go somewhere where you can clear your mind, okay? But you, you're not going to be able to grab everything right now. 
That's all I'm here. I'm not here to bother you. Stop. Please stop. Put it down. Cause you're gonna hurt if you just put it down. Please put that down. Cause I don't want you to hurt yourself, and I don't want to get hurt either. I'm not gonna hurt you. If the glass breaks and it shatters, it hits me in the eye. Hits you in the eye. It's not break it. Okay, but can I have it, please? Thank you. I'm not trying to bother you. Come on, when you get your stuff, come on back later. We'll come back later on. I'm not leaving without my dog. Your mama, she said your dog would stay here. I'm not leaving without my dog because she's the same person that you let her run out into the street before the police came. I'm not leaving. Like the mom, dog. give her that dog. Sorry about that. Oh, you're This is crazy work. Look at him. Coming back in the house. Come on. Let's go, Rachel. Come on. Don't figure that everyone else has heard the issue. No, you're the issue. Come on. Let's go. You got your stuff. Then dancing in her drawers like an old lady. Like, this is disgusting. She should be embarrassed. Good luck trying to figure out how Thank to handle you. Thank you. Thank you. I got it. I got it. I got it. Meanwhile, you ain't got nowhere to live. Listen to the mom. Bye. Listen to it. Bye. That's why Bye. I the car. Bye. Bye. Who she sound like? Bye. I'm really not struggling. I told you that. 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 They got a pocket piss in or throw out the front door. Man. That's a mother and daughter now. Hey, look. Yeah, sound, they sound the same, don't they? Look, she about to go to jail. Huh? She get her in the car, because she get in jail. Well. Is that your car? Yeah, that's my car. He don't want to take her. she break something in my presence, she already should have been already going to jail. Yeah, I think so too. Look at him. See, he don't want to take her. He don't want her at his house. She probably go there and terrorize his house. Look at her. She done made her way back in the house man, again. Come here. Turn around, man. I'm not about to do this. I'm not about to keep doing this. Come here, Rachel. You going with me. No, I just sat there watching. I mean, this is gonna be your last time, okay? You need to come right here. You need to get what you need to get and leave. Do not come back in here, cause I'm telling you right now, you getting ready. I, I watched you. All right, do something else then. That's right. Now you go. Okay. Okay. Wow. I've been real. Like that, I'm about to close the door. I'm about to close the door. She ain't come back in this house. What else did she break up there? She pushed over a, uh, uh, over a printer or something. Oh. Yeah, let's, let's close the door. She ain't come back in here. Alright. Grab your stuff. Rachel, Rachel, My you're dog. Not, you're not going back in. Now look at all them chances she could have. The mom says she ain't taking the dog, but she could. She ain't asked for that dog. She just want to fight. She really don't want to leave. But look at this. Oh, you see that? She kicked the man. Damn, she just kicked off in the face. Turn around. 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 Look at the granddaddy over here. Turn around. Turn around. We're not playing with you. Turn around. She said she can't breathe. Sarah, step back. I ain't doing that being nice no more. I'm done. See, you had a chance to take and put in the car. You wouldn't do it. Hold on. 
Exactly. Nobody even on her. She told me I can't breathe. That doesn't work in every scenario, man. Come on. But this when you done took it too far. See, now see, granddaddy right here, you had several opportunities to take this young lady, put her in the car, and leave. But you keep moving around, letting her do what she want to do because you're afraid of her. Let's just be real. You should have told the police to go ahead and take her. She need to go to a psych ward or somebody, see somebody medically or something. But see, trying to handle these little young crazy kids, once they done got out of hand, you got this old man trying to handle them. The mom don't want to deal with it no more. Didn't say, didn't call the dad to come get her. She granddaddy come over there. Why you didn't call the dad to come get her? Because the dad probably to deal with this same kind of mess, but at least that's the dad. He can't deal with her. He's an old man. Stop sending y'all kids to these old parents thinking they're supposed to handle these kids when you can't handle it. She's down there kicking. These young officers, they down there fighting with this girl. Now, if she would have had the right ones, oh, they would have snatched her. But they trying to be calm with her, but everybody ain't on that time. You done went too far now, young lady. You going to jail. Only thing you got to do is calm down. You over here fighting. I told you to calm, calm down. down. Shouldn't have caused injury to herself. And what he meant by that caused injury to himself when it showed it, but she started banging her head up against the wall when they start bringing her around. So you'll see some swelling in the top of her head when you see a different angle. Look, look at that right here. Look at granddaddy right here. He probably hoping they take her. Oh, and she did it on the car. I just want him to stop. Warrants. What they were trying to call me? <laughs> no, nah, I came because I didn't know Giles didn't come. <laughs> and I know what the car was. <laughs> she was supposed to be going with granddaddy, but she kept pushing and knocking over stuff. I, I told her she had because one more time. Because I'm depressed, because I'm tired. You don't understand. I do understand. Can't, you can't hit us. I do understand. You can't hit us. You just you. kicked me in the face. You, you kicked me in my hand. face. So and you tried to bite him. It's no tired. joke. I know everything I got. I know I beat you, but I did not kick you Yes, in your face. you did. Well, I apologize. But it I doesn't matter. It's too late for that. It's too late for that. Because you was hurting me. There's no tears in her eyes now. Nothing on her face. I told you I was not going to take you to jail. I told you. Just get your <laughs> we come back later. I am tired of this. It does not matter. You can't kick anybody in the face. If I, you kick, were if I me. kick somebody in the face, I would go to jail in uniform. Yeah. Well, you were hurting me. You were literally hurting me. That's what you need. You're hurting me. Now the granddad just said she need to be on her medicine. I know she need a lot, lot of medicine. I mean, we can tell she on something. But <sighs> It went too far now. <laughs> oh, and the cuffs loose and they're hurting my wrist. Oh, no, you are not coming out there. Where are you guys right here? I want water. 
water! She ain't the safe subject is in custody. So she keeps saying you hurting me. I bet she says that to everybody. And play that victim like everybody did something to her. Look at him. Watch out, sir. Back up, please. You keep fighting. You keep fighting. You keep fighting. Nobody's letting you go. You keep fighting. It might be too big. No. Nobody got their hand on your throat. No, it's not. No, it's not. My, my hand is on your my hand is on your chin. My hand is on your No. No, I'm serious. Like for real. No, it's not moving. I can't breathe. No, I'm serious. Can you just stop talking? Because Shut the fuck up, white. <laughs> so I should keep using that stuff. I can't breathe. Y'all hurting me when they be barely holding her. Can you imagine how she went and told people somebody did something to her when they haven't? See, she, see, she used to doing things for attention. This would bring people running, make it seem like somebody's hurting her, playing this big victim role, and they just standing there. Like, nobody's doing anything. She's just screaming that y'all hurt, it hurting. I'm telling you, man. Once they get this stage, ain't nothing you can do. There's nothing you can do. You can't send them to dad. And most of y'all, when these kids get out of hand, go stay with your daddy. Go do, no, no, no. Because we told you. We told you when you want to take on all these kids, don't want the dads involved, because of you and him don't get along, that has nothing to do with the child. But you want to take it on, don't let nobody say nothing to her, go fighting everybody every time somebody try to tell you about your badass kid. And so they let you just raise them. And now they like this. We all got some family members got these same type of kids at their house. And when they was kids, nobody could tell them nothing. You didn't want nobody to take them, nobody to keep them. You didn't want nobody to say nothing to them. But when they start getting out of hand, you want somebody to oh, go stay with your uncle, go stay with your aunt. No, don't come over here. I don't want you over here disturbing my peace with your badass kids. Calm down, calm down, we can adjust it for you. What's hurting on you? Oh, quit. Calm down and stand up. What's hurting on you? It's my wrist, it's my wrist, it's my wrist bone, like that buckle one right Okay, step back for me. Yes. Step back further for me. When you're combating us, we can't put it on correctly because you're fighting us. <laughs> Signal two at Stop moving. I'm trying to get it off for you. Trying to help you. Stay still. Alright, give him a second. He's trying to loosen it. Just stay still. Look at him. He's not even doing anything. Look at him. She probably wanted to loose him up so she can get her hand out. Stop. And you, and you bit me in my right hand. 
And then you kick your sergeant. <laughs> I didn't mean to kick him. I meant to bite you, but I didn't mean to kick him. You should have stopped. Why did you want to bite me? Because you were hurting me. I wasn't hurting you. It was hurting me. I was stopping you from going in the house. When I'm in pain, even when my dad used to hit me, I used to scratch him when he was hurting me. I'm not your dad. I don't care if I'm in danger and I feel like I'm being hurt, I'm going to hurt you because he was hurting me. All I was doing was stopping you from going in the house. No, you man. You see what she just said? Even when my dad tried to, I would scratch him. Undiscipline. Raised them up with no structure, no discipline. When somebody tried to discipline them, this is what you get. Every time. Every time. And y'all keep thinking, y'all don't need a man around. I know a lot of you going to go, oh, hey, man, uh. But most men have some structure behind them where it's like, you're not doing that. Stop that. They will tell you to stop. Now, a lot of you soft brothers out here now afraid to say anything, and you're letting your kids grow up in your presence acting like this. And then you go to another man to ask him to help you with your child. You know how many dudes then came to me and asked me to help them with their kid? It's ridiculous. I'm like, huh? Yeah, man, maybe he'll listen to you, man. You know, so you could talk to him a little bit. Why should he listen to me when you're you supposed to be the dad? But that's where we at now. Because y'all so afraid, the mom's going to get mad at you. You won't nobody tell your kid nothing, but when they grow up, they'll start telling you what to do. And that's where we at with this one here. Handle me and snatch me. The last time that dad happened to me was my dad. You were my fight and flight kicked in. <laughs> Look at him. My fight and flight kicked in. You see what I'm saying? She know all the, the right words. Let her go 10, 13. <laughs> and we're gonna get the warrants on her. I don't want to go to 1013. I just got out of oh, Emory. No, you going to 10, you, 10, you definitely 1013. You don't say you want to. She even know what they are. I said I want y'all to. Okay, that's the same thing. She know what the doggone police I don't numbers are. I don't want to go to a. I'd rather go to jail. Please don't send me there. Oh, you're going to psych ward. You're going. No, you can take me to jail. I don't want to go back to yeah, you're going to that juvenile facility and go probably going to be sitting up in the psych ward on that. And she keep acting the way they act, they're going to put on suicide watch and take everything from her. Listen to her. All you wanted was a mother's love. You say that. <laughs> this chick said all she wanted was her mother's love, and she can't get that. When she just sat in there and said she hoped her mother was deceased, would be deleted. Hope somebody delete her. But now you need mother's love. She know all the words. She done been through this several times. You see what I'm saying? So when she talked to these psychiatrists and stuff, she know all these little things to say. And that's when the kids thinking they smarter than what they think they are. But if you pay, you know what I'm saying? You have to go to jail because let's say you I'm go not, to and I'm let's say you I'm go to jail. <sighs> jail you are liable. So we're not playing I'm that not game. Gonna... We're, not, we're not even going to risk See, it. See, all the bleeping out the cursing she's doing. See? I just wanna lay down. Listen. Now look at the I'm swelling in her head. Right? See if I can pause it, bro. I don't wanna be too thirteen. Hmm? Like, no. Can y'all see that swelling in her head right there? Self-inflicted wounds. you definitely going to psych ward. You're going to be on suicide watch. They take everything from you, put you on that paper gown, and you'll be 72-hour watch, and then they're going to move you somewhere else. Right, cool. That's, that's not an accident. Why would I 
intentionally kicked this man in the face. Be for real. Why would I, I kick you? To get loose yeah, you but I did not mean to kick you in the face. You well, act like still, But you meant to bite me, though. That's still, yes, because that's you were hurting me. I'm not going to do this. Oh, I don't want to do this. Just take me to jail. Well, that's where you yeah. were going at first. She know where she's going. Where you were actually supposed to go with granddaddy. Remember? Please don't do it. I want to go with my daddy. I don't want to do this. Help me. Oh, now you're asking for help. Papa can't help you now. You went too far. I don't want to get in that ambulance. You want to have a choice. I don't want them to sedate me. I don't want to do none of this. Like, please. Please. I don't want to do this. No. They're not gonna take her while she's fighting like this. They're not. <laughs> she already said she don't want to go to the. Oh, they're gonna send her right back right to the. Please, I will act normal if you take me to the jail. Not on her head. She's self-inflicted <laughs> wounds on herself. Yeah. She's yeah, not raising this <laughs> for me. She's already said she wants us. She playing the role, that's she? Pretty much, I, I I was like, you know what? You're gonna go with me. So you can go with us. She started fighting us. She started bit me. She kicked him. And then she started banging her head. Once we got her cuss, she started banging her head, banging her head. She wants some. This is sad. You see how anytime somebody touch her, she act like they hurting her. She's asking now, how did she get here? Okay, so that's it on this. They just got to take her away. Now, there's a lot to unpack in this. And I seen, like I say, man, where I grew up, I seen a lot of this. And even in some times in between, even in recruiting, I seen some of this in some people's households. And um, I've actually had a kid, a, a young girl, that I, well, a couple of them that I was recruiting. And they would look like they 17, 18, 
around that age, 18, 17, you know, I've seen them go off on their parents, cuss them out, do all this stuff, and I had to pull them to the side. And I had to tell them, like, if I see that once again, you ain't coming in here. I had to check them, and I told the parents about it. I was like, we're not doing that. And that's the only thing that slowed them down. But the parents just sat there. And then some of them tried to have a nerd to call me when the child act up. Don't, don't, don't call me. Call her dad. But she going to do what you say? No, no, I'm not wasting my time on this. There's just people, man, I'm telling you, y'all got to learn to get these kids under control at an early age. You can't do it when they turn teens. You just can't do it. They should be able to have a small fear of you or a fear of what might happen to them or something. Y'all want to be best friends with these girls. Because y'all got a daughter. Y'all going to be best. Y'all want to hit the clubs together. Y'all hoping that ever happens. Y'all can wear the same clothes and makeup and go out and hang out and do all. No, it don't happen like that all the time. This is what happens. They in there cursing you out, telling you what to do. They got y'all keeping their kids. But I'm just saying, man, this the same old, same old that's running around circles and circles. She know the routine. She know the trigger words. She know all the stuff. She know what she's doing. She know exactly what she's doing. And maybe that's why the mom says she got to go because she's tired of it, but you created that. You and her grandfather helped create it. Well, guys, I hope y'all got something out. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this, man. I don't even know what, I mean, I don't even know what think y'all going to say besides this shit's just crazy. But make sure y'all hit that subscribe, like, and share on the way out. Appreciate y'all hanging out. Appreciate all the new subscribers. Always support the brother. A hey, much love. And it's your boy, and I'm up out of here. Peace. And I'm out.